Hello everyone. In this problem, we have given the values that is h is equals to 12.5 centimeter, and l is given that is 26.7 centimeter, and value of r is given that is 0 0.0397 centimeter. Also, value of velocity is 1.6 meter per second. As we know, the coefficient of viscosity is equals to p into r square divided by 32 v into l so we can say that the mu is inversely proportional to the v so if we increase the value of v that is volume of the system then the coefficient of viscosity goes on decreasing so we can say that if volume of the system changed then its viscosity is also changed Also from the above formula, we clearly see in there that is mu is directly proportional to r square. So if the tube get narrow, it means the value of r goes on decreasing. As we seen here, the mu is directly proportional to r square and r is in decreasing. It means mu is also decreasing so we can say that the flow will also decrease now if we change the density as we know density is equals to mass by volume so we can say density is inversely proportional to volume so in the first part we have already explained that the coefficient of viscosity is inversely proportional to the volume so if we increase the density then the volume goes on decreasing and the coefficient of viscosity will goes on increasing so from here we can predict that the coefficient of viscosity change with the density of liquid